This is a $25.8 million Beverly Hills mega mansion with impressive city views. It's got an underwater seating area, infinity edge pool, and so many other features that I am very excited to show you today. Now, before we begin, huge thank you to all of the listing agents involved with this listing. And before we start, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And now let's get into it. here today in bright and sunny Beverly Hills, Los Angeles, about to tour this absolutely remarkable modern home here right in front of me. We've got your driveway, which leads you up to your garage section. Also, you actually have this additional driveway space where you can easily have another like six to seven cars. So you've got plenty of parking here at this home. The home is also nicely gated off as well adding that extra element of privacy. Let's continue down. We've got the smooth stucco finish. We've got the tile work all along the exterior. We've got the stone pathway, which leads you up to your front door, surrounded by this beautiful foliage all throughout. Let's continue down and you've got your absolutely massive pivot door, which further takes us into the remarkable open concept entry. We've got the staircase here positioned on my right, collection of light fixtures above. In front of me, you've got access into spaces which include your family room, formal dining room, and your kitchen. On my right, you've got a formal seating space and a bar. And then down on my left, you've got the garage access and the yoga studio. Also, you've got the stair access taking you down below where you've got the entertainment space, which has an underwater living area. Then we have level three, which has the expansive primary bedroom suite. And of course, we're gonna tour all of these floors throughout the video, but before we do, we gotta go from the entry here into the elevator. It's wrapped with this very unique wallpaper design, even going up on the ceiling. Definitely the most detailed elevator we have seen to date. Now let's continue outside of this section right here. On my right, you've got access into your two car garage, which has a sleek tile floor. You've got some built out cabinetry, access to that private driveway. And then on my left, you know, if you wanna pull into your house, you wanna do some yoga, looking out at the picture window views, this is the exact spot to do it. You've also got the mirror details built out across this entire room. Imagine doing your morning yoga, watching the sunrise, overlooking these picturesque views every day. Pretty remarkable to me. Now let's continue outside of this section. We've got a lot of things to see right here. Of course, the expansive entry. We've got access into the kitchen on my left and various seating sections. But before we see those spaces, follow me through here. This is your formal living room area, which completely opens up to the backyard. You get the gorgeous views. You've got the contemporary staging throughout, beautiful light fixture above. You've got this marble assembly, which goes all the way up to the ceiling, which also is book matched perfectly in the center. And also we have this picture window, which looks over your pool and all of the foliage in the distance. One more thing we have to talk about, get a little closer. Look at this tic-tac-toe board, which has been completely built out with these marble pieces. Little things like that are just things that we never see. Also in front of me, we gotta show you one more detail. This is actually a secret room behind this extremely heavy door. We've got a bit of a coat closet, pretty cool. Could be a safe room if you want. You've got the beautiful tile work details, kind of sectioning off the space. You could barely tell that door is there. Now you get a ton of natural light in this section, of course, 
Marble details continue, and they're also book matched here at this bar area. You've got seating for three. You've got the espresso toned cabinetry all inside of this section. You've got your built in sink, mirrored backsplash with just again the impeccable staging all throughout right here. Now across the way, we've got access into your powder room, which again features these similar marble details shown on this floating vanity, wrapping the mirror of this section. You've got the very unique sink right here. Pull the handle and you've got your water. Fabricated sink, of course, complete with the beautiful glass light fixtures. And if you wanna make this area kind of hidden in secrets, you can literally just close it off like so. You can make it look like a secret room. Pretty cool detail. Now, if we continue outside of the space, we're back into your main entry. We've got access into the kitchen in front of me and the backyard. But before we see those spaces, let's take a turn to my left. Inside of here, we've got a beautiful powder room with a wallpaper design. You've got the built-in floating vanity with this vessel sink, unique faucet as well. Pull the switch and all your water comes out like the last one. Then you've got a beautiful light fixture positioned in the center of this room. Now let's take a turn here to my left-hand side. This leads us into the well-appointed kitchen, which has two kitchen islands. The first one has bar seating for several of your guests. You've got more of that remarkable white marble detail on these countertops, which we saw previously in the other living area. You've got the glass light fixtures above, beautiful custom cabinetry work is shown throughout. You've got your Mila designed five burner range wrapped with the marble details surrounding and then press the button right here and then your hood actually comes out of the countertop. So you don't have this big clunky hood taking up any space. You've got the very open concept kitchen, which I am truly a fan of. Then just press a button and it completely goes back into the countertop there. That's pretty remarkable. Now you've got your fabricated sink right here, complete with more custom cabinetry throughout. On my right, you've got your Mila appliance suite, complete with your espresso machine, microwave and double oven setup. And next to that, you've got yourself a spot for your flat screen TV. In case you wanna watch the game while you're eating breakfast, you could absolutely do that. Of course, it's surrounded by more custom cabinetry. If we continue through here, you've actually got a little secondary kitchen area, complete with more of the espresso toned upper and lower cabinetry spaces. You've got another built-in sink designed by Mila, and you've also got some underglow over here below your upper cabinetry. Now let's continue through the kitchen. There's a couple more things we gotta talk about here. You've got another stainless steel sink, overlooking your foliage. Now, if we continue through, you've actually got built-in Thermidor freezer one and freezer two. And then next to that, you've got your refrigeration sections. So a total of four doors, definitely the most amount of storage you could possibly ask for. And what's really cool is that you actually have this secret door, which further leads you into your remarkable formal dining table, which has seating for 10, Another grand light fixture is centered above this table. More floating shelving is wrapped around the space. It looks very luxurious and I'm a huge fan of it, really. Now in front of me, we've got your contemporary staged family room. Again, high ceilings, picture window views, looking out to the foliage. And we've got these pocket sliding doors which completely lead you out to the remarkable backyard giving you that seamless indoor outdoor living experience. You can be in here feeling that Beverly Hills breeze every day. I'm a huge fan of the space. Also built in spot for your flat screen TV over there. I'm a huge fan of all the artwork shown across this entire section as well. And if we continue back down, that pretty much wraps up our tour for this entire main level. So now we're gonna head outside and check out the remarkable backyard. just made it out to the absolutely spectacular backyard right off of your kitchen and your formal living area. We've got a covered patio space with some contemporary seating. You've got the built out flat screen TV area, this large turf section, 
four pool chairs right off of one of my most favorite infinity edge pools that we have ever seen on the channel here. You've got the Baja shelf where you can easily have another like seven or eight pool chairs. You've also of course got your completely seamlessly integrated jacuzzi space. And next to that, one of my most favorite features, once again, is the built-out underwater bar seating. You've got the marble countertop inside the water. I can promise you we have never seen anything like that before. It's a infinity edge, of course. It overlooks the contemporary architecture of the property. You've got some more cushioned seating sections glass railing throughout, complete with all of the beautiful landscaping. You've got the fire pits, bench seating, more outdoor staged seating sections, and you've also got an outdoor kitchen here, which is complete with seating for four. We've got your covered off outdoor kitchen with even more marble details, which is pretty impressive to see on the exterior here. You've got the fabricated sink with more marble details. You've got your, of course, built-in ice maker next to that. Some refrigeration, of course, complete with all of the cabinetry. And what else is really cool right here is that, of course, you've got your outdoor mounted flat screen, but if you wanna section it off, just slide back these marble looking dividers, which is just so cool. You wanna open it up, just slide back your marble stone pieces. Talk about attention to detail, I love that. Of course, as much cabinetry as you could possibly imagine shown here on the exterior. It's also nicely shaded off. You've got the outdoor heaters as well, just in case it gets a little cold. You're complete with the beautiful views, ocean in the distance, complete with the Wilshire Corridor and Century City just down in the distance. I mean, this backyard is perfect. It checks every box anyone could possibly need. I just love how blue the pool looks, complemented with this contemporary architecture. Let's continue down. The turf section continues. We've got more seating sections and art installations. Massive Zen plant life is also shown all throughout this entire section. You've got an exterior staircase, which leads you down into another tranquil seating area. That space also takes you down into your underwater seating section and a couple more rooms. Those are all shown on the third entertainment level. And we're actually gonna head down there and check it out right now. So let's do it. just made it down to the remarkable lower entertainment level. This area has rooms which include your movie theater, wine cellar, guest bedroom, living sections, and one of the coolest underwater features we've ever seen. First things first, I wanna take you right in here. This is the well-appointed movie theater. We've got dual tiered seating in the section. You've got the massive screen on the far end integrated speakers and wall sconces can also be found throughout this section here. Such a cozy space to sit and relax with your friends and family. You've also got some built-in cabinetry sections. Of course, guys, they're all soft closing. You know that's my favorite. And then also you can actually completely section off the area from this double door access. Now let's continue back down. You can see we're at the lower landing. You've got that floating staircase, which takes us all the way up to level three, which again, we're gonna be seeing a little bit later. Now in front of me, we've got the wine cellar, an outdoor section and a guest bedroom, but we're gonna wait. We're gonna show you guys those spaces a little bit later. Before we do, I wanted to mention this contemporary seating area positioned next to your staircase. You've got the chandelier above, and right next to this area, you have a bit of a bar section. We've got the espresso wood tones all throughout. You've got the floating shelving, marble countertops, all of the cabinetry, of course, guys, is indeed soft closing. And next to me here, you've got your built-in ice maker. Absolutely essential for any bar section. Now in front of me, this is where we have space for the fabricated sink, Marble countertops continue with this mirrored backsplash, and this entire built-out assembly is actually floating off the ground, which I thought was a pretty cool detail. Now over here on my left-hand side, we've got access into some additional closet storage, and if we continue right in front of me, guys, I swear, 
This is probably the coolest living room we have ever seen to date in any of my house tours. And I'm sure you can see why. You've got this clear story window, which looks out to your pool water. That is crazy. So you get this really amazing blue natural light effect into this room. It feels like we're kind of underwater. It feels like we're on a cruise ship in this room. This makes me so happy and so excited. I could sit here and get work done all day long. This is absolutely crazy. And if you're swimming in the pool and you've got friends in here, you can maybe go in the pool, wave hello to them. Maybe your friends can be playing a game of pool here at this billiards table. You've got the light fixture above. You've got the unique wallpaper design throughout this entire section, lounge seating, mounted flat screen TVs. You've got it all in this space. It seriously checks all the boxes. Talk about a cool attention to detail. Now let's continue down. We've got a powder room here. Again, you've got more unique wallpaper details throughout this entire section. You've got the hanging light fixture. You've got the massive bowl vessel sink mounted on top of your vanity here. Mounted mirror, seriously, it looks amazing. Now follow me down this hallway right over here. And if we further go down, we've got the elevator access here on my right. And furthermore, this is your completely temperature controlled wine cellar, which has space for hundreds of your favorite bottles of wine right here, built out completely from the floor all the way to the ceiling. There's no way I can reach those ones up there, but this is just so remarkable. You've also got a little floating shelf space in here too, in case you wanna have a little wine tasting moment. You can absolutely do that in here. Now let's continue down. This is your laundry room. Of course, you've got the built out floor to ceiling cabinetry, custom uppers and lowers. You've got space for four appliances. And I've never seen this, but you've even got a flat screen TV in here too. Pretty crazy. Now let's continue back outside of the section on my right. You've got another kind of storage room. And now let's continue down this hallway right over here. This is gonna take us to an outdoor section and two guest bedrooms. Let's head over here first. This is the first guest bedroom that we will be seeing for this level. You've got the built out cabinetry positioned all along this side of the wall. You've also got yourself a massive pocket slider, which indeed leads you out to that remarkable outdoor section, which I previously mentioned here. Beautiful space. It's surrounded by the foliage here. It feels very zen and tranquil. You've got the built-in fireplace in the center. And then I also just wanted to mention this. This is one of these floating egg chairs that we've seen in a couple properties, but imagine you're on your laptop here, surrounded by the foliage. That's truly something special. Now we've got access into the other guest bedroom in front of me, but before we see that, we actually have to take you up this set of stairs. And this takes you to something again, we've never seen before on the channel. And this right here is your kind of covered off outdoor, indoor gym experience. You've got the mirror details across this entire section. You've got all of your necessary gym equipment in here as well. It's nicely railed off with the glass. You've got some plant life details in front of you as well. So you can be having a super hard workout, but you can still be feeling that cool breeze here in Beverly Hills, which I think is really cool. And then of course, it's surrounded by these concrete walls. It gives you that industrial feeling. Up here, we've got exterior access back up to the driveway. And if we continue down, we're back into that first guest bedroom, which I mentioned over here. We've got the ensuite bathroom, complete with marble details and a glass enclosed shower, which doubles as a bathtub. And if we continue back down, we gotta talk about the next guest bedroom here. Again, staged with contemporary furniture. You've got the built out closet there on my left, staged desk area, and then you've got the ensuite bathroom once again with more marble details situated all throughout. You've got the floating vanity, of course, and that glass shower has a rain head, and it's also got a body spray. Now let's continue back down here. Also, you can access this outdoor space from this pivot door, which is pretty cool. Now, you've also got some additional stair access back up to the backyard. But that pretty much concludes our tour for this entire lower level. So now we're actually gonna jump back up and check out floor three. So let's do it right now. to the top.
top level of the home. This is the landing. You've got the glass railing sectioning off this space. You've got views of the chandeliers in front of me, all of the foliage in the distance. You've got your elevator access, and you also have two guest bedrooms here. We're gonna see these actually a little bit later, but first things first, I wanna take you down here to this private hallway, which exclusively takes you into the primary bedroom suite. You've got the unique wallpaper details on this far side of the wall right here. Also, separate seating section. You've also got your mounted flat screen TV with the glass fireplace positioned below with this very unique kind of glass reflective material surrounding the space. Beautiful artwork has been installed all throughout this section. And let's talk about the views and the balcony for a second. You can see we currently have all of the glass doors completely pocketed into the wall. So when you're out here, you can't even really tell if you're inside or you're outside. You just get that amazing seamless flow right here, looking out some of the best views in all of Beverly Hills. Century City, the Wilshire Corridor, all of this Beverly Hills foliage, and more importantly, the ocean all the way there in the distance. You've got some seating sections. If you look up above me, you can even see the reflection of the pool right here on this cantilever. I'm just such a big fan of this property. And this primary bedroom is absolutely no exception. Every detail you could possibly need. You can wake up to that fresh breeze every morning. You've got the wall sconces on either side of the bed. That's not all, we've got so much more to see. So follow me down through here. Let's take a left-hand turn right here. This leads us into your closet storage. It's again, completely built out from the floor all the way to the ceiling. Interesting design. All of these doors actually slide open. A feature we don't normally see, especially in closets, but that's really cool. You've got the LED light strips surrounding the section, illuminating the space. You also get some views right here too from your closet. How rare is that? You can look out to Century City in the Wilshire Corridor while you're picking out your favorite t-shirt for the morning. It's pretty, pretty crazy. All glass paneled, of course, here. And if we take a turn here to my right-hand side, this leads us into one half of the primary bathroom. You've got the floating vanity with the built-in sink. You've also got your mounted mirror, marble details completely border this entire section, even shown here on the floors. Now you've got the glass enclosed shower as well, which again gets just remarkable views of Beverly Hills and Century City and the ocean in the distance. More marble, of course. You've even got, come in here, you've got a little built-in sink inside of your shower. I have never seen anything like this before. Seriously, look at that. That is so crazy. We've got the built-in bench seating, views of the pool, mounted rain head above me. I mean, I couldn't ask for anything more. This is absolutely perfect. Now displayed here across the hall, this leads us into the main event. This is your main primary closet. The other one was just for fun. This is truly what it's all about. It's completely built out with all of this custom cabinetry in this espresso tone. You've got the sliding glass panel doors once again, which lead you into the contemporary spaces to hold your clothing, illuminated with those LED light strips. You've got the beautiful center island with the glass panel top, complete with, again, these jewelry organizers, your accessory organizers. Also, if you look right here, all of your cabinetry is completely soft closing, more glass paneled sliders throughout. It's amazing. Let's continue down. You actually have a bit of a seating section positioned in between both of your vanities. You've got the double vanity in front of me floating off the ground with the fabricated sinks. You've got the mounted mirror with the marble details situated all throughout right here. Gorgeous chandelier hangs above this space. And on my right, you've got another vanity completely floating off the ground with the mounted mirror, more marble details. And if you wanna sit right here while you're a little tired in the morning, you can watch your TV here on the right and you can get that fireplace going, make it nice, warm and cozy in this open space. What else I really like is that if we continue down, you've got this marble detail here on the floors, which goes up into this freestanding tub. You've got the clear story windows lining the space bringing an abundance of natural light here when you're showering, when you're taking a bath. 
you've got the mounted rain head above with the built-in body spray, linear drainage, and what's really cool is that you don't really have a door to enter the space. You kind of just go in and out as you please. You can overlook the foliage. You've also got the frosted window, which adds an abundance of privacy in here as well. Also here, you've got some full body mirrors. You actually got a couple more in front of me right over in the closet space. Now let's continue through. You can also section off the area with this sliding door. And if we continue our tour through this space, you actually have this secret wall, which is in fact a door, and it leads you into this contemporary seating area. You've got a desk section, built out book shelving, of course, right over here. You've got the mounted flat screen, and you've also got some of the best views here in the city. Looking over your blue infinity edge pool, I just couldn't think of anything more perfect. Now follow me back out through this way. This leads us back into this upper level landing. We're nicely railed off with the glass. We've got the beautiful collection of light fixtures and let's actually head here down to my left hand side. We've got a pivot door which takes you into a guest bedroom. You've got the contemporary staging throughout. Clear story, frosted window, brings natural light. You've also got your built out cabinetry positioned here on my right. And of course, it is all soft closing, which we love. Plus, you've got a picture window overlooking the foliage in the distance. And if we continue down here to my right, this is your ensuite bathroom, complete with the floating vanity. You've got the mounted mirror above, marble details on the walls and the floors. And then you've also got your glass enclosed shower, which again is complete with more of those details all throughout. And if we head back outside, from your pivot door, we're back to the landing. We've got the elevator on my left and then another guest bedroom here on my right. Another pivot door takes you into the space. You've got more contemporary seating all throughout. Beautiful picture windows. Some of the best picture window views we may have ever seen before from a bedroom. You've got the Beverly Hills foliage complete with the city in the distance. And then this space also has an ensuite bathroom complete with the floating vanity. Once again, more stone details wrap the walls and the floors of this space. Then you've got the glass enclosed shower with the bathtub combination. And from this space, you also get some of the best picture window views we have ever seen. Now that, ladies and gentlemen, concludes our tour today for this remarkable property here in Beverly Hills. If you haven't already, make sure to check all of the information in the description to find out all of the agents and the pricing involved with this listing. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.